This is Nellie Deutsch, and I'm on one of my favorite tools. Actually, it is my favorite tool to create video tutorials for uh, learners. So let's take a look at Screencast-O-Matic. It's really, really easy. It's completely free. And if you want to use the writing tools, it costs something like $10 a year. Does that make sense? If you do it for three years, otherwise, I think it's something like 15 Really, really uh, cheap. All right, so let's uh, take a look and uh, get some more information about Screencast-O-Matic. Okay, so I'm going to take a look at the welcome. All right, so this is the welcome. Here's information. You can upload it to YouTube and Vimeo and Google Drive and so on for completely free. Here are the prices. Like I said, okay, so the Pro is $15 a year, and I think if you do it for three years, it's like $10. But take a look at what you get for free. You get 15 minutes. Pro is no. Okay. Um, max. You can do it for as long as you want. I've done it for three hours. Even more, I think. You can record screen and webcam. Publish on YouTube HD for free. Publish as MP4, AVI, and so on. But the other things like editing tools and so on is only for the pro. But I think it's really, really worth it because you're going to get a lot of mileage out of this amazing, absolutely amazing tool. You can also edit everything. So it's really worth your while. All right, so let's take a look at what I do in order to um, get this going. I'm using Camtasia to record, but I really prefer uh, Screencast-O-Matic. The only reason I use it, I use the Mac, and right now they don't have a Mac for second voice, in other words, for an internal voice. It's just my voice that could be heard and not something else. Uh, so let's continue. So I'm going to go into my Screencast-O-Matic that I've downloaded to my computer. You see it's loading, and this is right now I'm going to, it's in HD mode. Okay, let me just uh, make sure that you see that. It's in HD mode. So I'm going to get it in the center here. Okay, you click over here and you can move it. All right, so I've centralized it so you can see it better. And then you can also see uh, the tools up here. Notice uh, that's the record button. And then you've got Full HD and others, if you're interested. And then Highest, of course. You can also record with uh, your camera. You can get your camera in there. I'm not going to do that right now. But these are really, really great features. And, of course, the HD, which is amazing. All right, so let's take a look at uh, our Moodle. Okay, so, so I can show you how to screen share. and use this amazing tool. All right, so let's go into the uh, Moodle website. Okay. Uh, what you're seeing now is Moodle MOOC 5. Okay, which is going to take place in October. Right now we're in Moodle MOOC 4. All right, so this is uh, the website and I am Recording this through Screencast-O-Matic, and I'm showing you how I'm doing it with Camtasia. All right, so um, the screen is kind of small. Okay, so uh, let's go to our course, Moodle MOOC, and show you how you can do a demo. So I'm going to go into the course, uh, which is Moodle for Beginners. But I need to go in because I'm not logged in. So let me log in. You should forget your login details. Say forgotten, but make sure that you either send your email or your username. All right, so I'm in the center here. I'm not showing you the whole page. And I'm going to go into week two and resources. In week two, you're supposed to add your work here, but 
you do the practice and the recording in the Moodle practice area. Okay, and the Moodle practice area is right here. It's still week two. Okay, so let's go into the Moodle practice area. It's also in your profile as one of your courses because you're automatically at it. Okay, so there you can see, wow, what is that? Somebody from China or from Japan or somewhere. Sorry if I don't recognize uh, the beautiful font there, the language. Oh, honeymoon, that's cute. All right, so notice that they are in the wrong area. Okay, so um, I'll take care of that afterwards. The area that you're supposed to practice is right here, and I'm going to use the uh, tool here. Okay, is right here, and the tool comes from Screencast-O-Matic. So let's click there, the resource area. That's where you're supposed to practice your resources. And now we're in the resource area. Okay, you can see it's white here, and this is the resource area. But before you do anything, you need to click editing on. And then you're able to edit. Okay, so that's what I'm doing right now. And I'm going to move these things because they're in the wrong place. All right, so let's start with do not add, and yet they added. Okay, so let me add it to this part. There we go. It says insert below. And they did that, didn't they? Oh, I see. They moved it. Okay, so let's add it here. Oops. Okay, you could do this and help me out as well. Okay, so let's take all their work. There is a book here. You only need this in order to um, create your um, tutorial, which is what I'm doing basically. I'm showing you things. Am I right? I'm showing you things by using Screencast-O-Matic. See, I'm moving things down and you're looking at it and you're seeing how it's done. Somebody said you're posting in the wrong area. Okay. So let me, okay, that's it. I think that we got rid of everything. Do not post your work here. Uh, add it under the respective week. Okay, and then this is for week three, the activity area. So let's see if anybody's added anything here so far. Of course. Oh, okay, they have already, but that's okay. All right, so let's go back to the resource area. So what you're doing, actually, you're practicing and you're uh, conducting a screencast thematic video tutorial explaining what you did. So let me show you how that's done in very basic ways. You, first of all, add a label to your area. I believe I had my area here. There's Nelly. Okay, so I'm going to go into this area here. Okay, let me show you where it is using Screencast-O-Matic. There's the arrow from Screencast-O-Matic, but that costs money. I just realized it. $15 a year or $10 for three years. Okay, so once it's opened up, Okay, I can add anything, but I'm not going to add it here. I'm supposed to add it in the resource. Okay, so in the resource, under my name, okay, right here is where I'm going to move it eventually. Okay, so add an activity, and I'll choose a resource, of course, a resource, and the resource is label. I'll show you how to add a label. Okay. And now the label will go somewhere. Notice where it's going to go. It's going to go there. Um, and then I'll take care of it. I'll write, uh, wait until the rich editor comes up and it will just a question of time. Now I split it up. Notice it's in one. Let me show you how you split it. So that it becomes three actually not two there. Okay. There you see now it's three and I'm going to add help. And then I'm going to add, make it larger. So I'll make it, well, paragraph here. Make it big heading, okay? In case you're wondering, this is where I went. And then I'm also going to record my voice. I hope I don't sound like a chipmunk. Okay, there. And I'm going to say a few words here. This is a label. I can do anything in a label, including add videos. So this is Nelly, and I'm just playing around here, trying to do another demo, which is what you're supposed to be doing. But I love doing this so much using Screencast-O-Matic that um, if you ask me questions, I'll just keep doing it.
And it's true. So this is Nelly, and I'm just playing and around. I'll click on to insert do demo, which is what you're supposed to be doing. But okay. I love doing this so much using screencast. There. Okay, so now it's up there. Let me just add it there. And then I'm going to not restrict to anything, save it, and then you'll see it in a second. Okay, so uh, let's see if it's in the right place. Well, probably not. I'll have to move it. You see, it's down here, and I want to move it up under my name. Okay, so I'll have things organized. So there, I'll move it up to where my name is. And where am I? Ah, there she is. Just under Nelly. Oh, came above. Let's try again. There. No, still there. So you play around with it until you get it. Yeah, I got it. Under Nelly. Okay, now let's listen. So this is Nelly, and I'm just... Okay, Nelly playing around. And that's it. Okay, so then you stop it. Okay, so um, I have stopped. And let me stop it. Done. And then let me show you what happens next, because I'm screen sharing for you. So uh, there it is. Okay, and then I'm... Notice what I'm doing here. I'm going to go into, give it a name, of course. I'll call it Demo on Demos, right? Basically, Tutorials. Click on YouTube. So I'll get it there. Okay, and then upload to YouTube. I hope you can see that. Upload to where to go? Upload to YouTube. Okay. There we go. Upload this to YouTube. Okay, I don't need to show the rest. There, make it larger. Okay, uh, there we go. Upload to YouTube, and then look what happens. Okay, there it's going. Okay, you see, and you'll see it on YouTube. But in the meantime, let me go back to for this and show you once it's done, and it's going to be uploading to YouTube. I'm going to add it. So let's go back to class, back to class. There it is, back to class. Click on black to back to class. Okay, and um, my course is uh, beginners. Okay, so I'm going to go into beginners. Okay, Moodle for beginners. And let me show you where I'm going to add my work. And I'm going to go into resources right here. Okay, go into resources and I'll add it response area for resources okay so I'll click here this is where I add it okay I'll uh, add a new discussion topic okay wait for the um, rich editor split it up into three write my topic demo of a demo um, use it okay so I'll call it demo of a demo, demo of a demo using screencast o -matic. Now I'm going to add it later, okay? Demo of a demo with screencast o -matic. Okay, I'll add that later, right now, because I, I can do this. Okay, hopefully it'll come up. I'll Post it to the form. Okay, continue, but it's going to continue anyways. And then I'm going to leave this open so I can edit and add my work. Okay, as soon as the screencast-o-matic is ready. Let's see what's happening with the screencast-o-matic. So far it's 45% because, wow, it's long. I didn't think I was talking for seven minutes. Was I talking for seven minutes? minutes that's a long time you see what happens is you should make these as short as you can but uh, time really seems to fly when you're creating these videos so um, let's wait around until this happens okay so as you can see um, the video is ready so let's click on it and go to YouTube so we can get the link and I'll show you how that's done. Okay, so here it is. There's the video. Notice and use this it's, amazing uh, HD. Tool. I can right, view so it. Let's go into the uh, Moodle website. See how nice that is because it's okay. HD. 
You just wait a few seconds while it initializes. Oh, what you're now is Moodle and Luke. it's very clear. Five. All right, so let's um, stop it. We'll get um, the link. Okay, go into share, get the link, copy it. Now we're going to go into the class. Okay, so um, let's find the Moodle. There we are. Okay, now let me just um, refresh it to make sure that I don't get any error messages. All right, so as you can see, there it is. Let's wait a few more seconds until the editor is up. All right, now demo of a demo, and then look what I do I paste the link. I am going to highlight it, go into hyperlink, hyperlink it. I can make it in this frame or I can make it in the blank, it doesn't really matter because it's going to be a video. Now, look what it looks like. That's what it looks like. Okay, so um, let me go into the recording and say hello. Okay, I hope you enjoyed that. Okay, I hope you enjoyed that. Insert. Okay, so I also have a file here. Okay, so let's add it there. Okay, the video is going, notice what's going to happen here. Okay, there's the link to the video. I'm going to scroll down, save. Okay, now I can either click on continue, I can just ignore it. It'll, there it is. Okay, and there it is. So there's the video of the demo. And use this amazing, okay, showing you the tour. And here's my, uh, okay, I hope you enjoyed that. All right, so that's it. So reply to this. Do I give myself a grade? No, but I'll give you a grade. You can be sure of that. All right, so I hope. Um, I'll get comments on this. It was kind of long, but uh, that's the price you pay when you want to show a lot very quickly.